Okay, so today I am on the beach where we used to run our surf school and I'm just uh, kind of getting everything together to get it off the property here at the Four Seasons uh, and it's going to go into storage for, for the foreseeable future. At the earliest, the hotel is planning to open back up here in July. Um, that, doesn't that doesn't mean we're going to have work straight away or that yeah that will be back here operating or anything like that so it's interesting times here to give you a bit of a look just filling up the car with with everything we can i gotta get boards on the roof as well and here's the here's the shop which we just finished setting up to be honest um to kind of get going uh, because we had a, a brand change here and um, yeah yeah now it's it's finished it's all done for yeah perhaps perhaps forever perhaps just for a little while we'll find out uh oh Plenty of boards on the roof. Going off the beach. And uh, car is full of stuff too. Hey buddy. Look at his friends. Man, it's just so much more wildlife than there typically is here. That's really cool. <laughs> Really, really cool. Hey friends around the world, it's the 24th of March here in Costa Rica. A little update about the situation here. There's now 177 cases. Uh, the, the same rules are kind of in place as they were yesterday. Almost all non-essential businesses have been shut down. Today I went into where we used to work on the uh, Papagoya Peninsula and removed all of our equipment. Uh, our, our surf school equipment so that's all done which was nice it was actually really nice to get out of the house and go feel productive all day long so that was great um yeah pretty much the rest is is pretty much the same here a couple more cases oh china donated a whole bunch of medical supplies to costa rica and i imagine they're going to be doing that to a lot of countries around the world uh, because it seems as though you know, they've got it under control in their country and now they're kind of on the front foot helping out other countries. Anyway, we'll see how all of that goes. We'd love to hear how everyone's doing wherever they're living. And if you've got any specific questions, just let me know. Cheers.